Me and Emma decided to do our project on the conservation of manatees. Manatees help control the vegetation that obstructs Florida waterways by processing vegetation they eat and passing it back into the environment as a form of fertilizer. Manatees feed on more than 65 species of floating, emergent, or submerged aquatic plants and grasses, leaves and shoots, and on seagrass beds with fresh water and seawater. Manatees have a major ecological impact on their environment because of their ability to take in various nutrients and recycle them back into the environment. Manatees consume food for almost half of the day, eating about 10% of their body weight. Manatees often encounter ocean vessels while searching for food because they feed on seagrass, which needs sunlight and shallow water to survive. Seagrass grows in the same body of water that is often traveled by boats. Therefore, manatees risk a deadly encounter every time they travel for food, because they do not have enough time to get out of the way of a collision. Last year, there were a total of 136 manatees who died after being struck by a water vessel. The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service's primary objective of their Endangered Species Program is to protect endangered and threatened species, such as manatees, and restore them to a secure status in the wild. The USGS Florida Integrated Science Center administers the Serenia Project, focused on long-term research on the West Indian manatee in Florida. They have caught a total of 120 manatees in the last five years in order to establish a profile for their health and the reproductive potential they have. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission has established manatee protection zones to reduce the speed and operation of motor vehicles in order to protect manatees from harmful collisions with, with vessels. The Manatee Rescue and Rehabilitation Center is composed of a group of different organizations whose primary mission is to track the well-being of rehabilitated manatees in the wild. Their goal is to rescue and rehabilitate sick and injured manatees so they are able to be released back into the ocean.